right, so in this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can overclock and undervolt your GPU. You're going to need the software MSI Afterburner. And in order to test your overclocks, you're going to need Heaven Benchmark and or Value Benchmark. But for the sake of this video, I'm going to be using one of my games to test the settings. And I will leave links in the description so you can download these softwares yourself. Okay, so since we're going to be going in game, we are going to want to monitor our stats and we're going to need River Tuner in order to do that. So when you install MSI Afterburner, make sure you have River Tuner ticked. It's going to give you a little option. So I didn't do that. So I'm just going to have to download it manually. Okay, so after you've installed River Tuner, you're going to want to click on the cogwheel and go into the settings. You then want to go to monitoring and you then tick the settings which you want to see in the on-screen display. So for example, say I want this one to be seen, the FP usage. I'll go down here and click show in on-screen display. And that's pretty much it. So you just tick, tick the things that you want to see. And that's, that's, that's all. Another thing which you want to do is to go into, where is it? Another thing which you want to do is to come into the on-screen display tab and make sure you set some hotkeys for the different functions. So say, toggle on screen display F2 and show on screen display F1. So make sure you set these two. And once you're in game and you don't see the on screen display, you can press whichever one of these buttons and it should show up. Okay, so here's the plan. We first, first off, we increase the power limit and temperature limit. This should be linked. Just max that all the way. And we want to increase the core clock and memory clock uh, by say pick any number that you want say 100 you start off at about 100 memory clock you can only uh, bump these up a little bit higher so i'll take this to like around 200 and you can then apply this setting so you can after this you can then increase it for increments of 30 or so and for every increment you will want to go into a game and test it and see if the overclock is stable okay so here we can see the performance before overclocking and the performance afterwards my clock speed is up by 126 megahertz and you can see that there's quite a big improvement on our fps of about 13 frames okay so we've definitely gained some fps right but there's a problem my gpu is now at 84 degrees and the fan speed is at 75 percent which is pretty loud so now what we're now what we're gonna do is we're going to bring that down and we're going to do that by undervolting the GPU. So let's do that. Another thing is we're, going, we're also going to try and keep the clock speed about the same. So right now it's at 1911. So let's do that. Okay, to start undervolting your GPU, we're going to want to click on this little thing here, which is next to the core clock. This is gonna, going to bring up this interesting graph that we have here. And now what we want to do is for the same clock speed that we have, that we saw during the gameplay, we want a smaller amount of voltage going to the GPU. So at the moment, it was at about 1031 or so around here. And what we want to do is move it to here. Now, what that will do is it'll lower the temperatures for the GPU 
and this will then also lower the GPU fan speed, making it quieter. So let's do that. Okay, so I know my voltage is around 943 in order to get the same amount of clock speed, but for you, you're going to have to test at different voltages, say differences of 25. So you can go to 1000, 975, 950, 925, or and thereabout, and test for each each voltage. So I already know mine is stable around here. So if I go here, set this at, you also want to press L to fix it to that point, and then go back to MS Afterburner and press apply. Another thing which you also want to do is lower these parts behind. After you've done that, you then want to go back, press apply again, and this will straighten out the graph. So your GPU won't go higher, whatever clock speed that you've set. So now what we have to do is test this and make sure that it's stable. Okay, so we can now see that my GPU fan speed is at 59%. The clock speed is about the same. It's gone down a little bit. And my GPU temperature is at 80 degrees. So it actually has come down. Success. So I'm just gonna play through this section just to make sure that it's stable. Good day, Lady Amicia. Those new rivets will have to wait. By the way, oh, any news Lady about Amicia. the town? Did you have a good Everyone walk? On edge. Later, Floor. Tell the others that the forest is out of bounds until further notice. Oh, um, yes, I'll, I'll tell them. Keep us from evil. May you forever grant us health and keep plague from our door. I hope Mother's not too busy. Ah, this sunshine won't last long. The rain has already ruined the harvest. People are dying of hunger. Ah, Gabrielle. Like his mother upstairs. House. Yes, she words. spent the night there. The little one had You're another right one of his that. attacks. <sighs> she won't be in a good mood. Yes, Lady Beatrice, leave it to me. Louise. Have you been to see Mother? Indeed. Um, do you... do you want to see her? It's important. Father's orders. Oh, in that case, sir, I have to finish your room. By the way, I've left a little something for you on your bed. Come and see if you like. Ah, thank you. Okay, so my GPU has actually come down a few degrees, which is interesting. Which is good, actually. And yeah, everything seems stable. The clock speed is still the same, uh, voltage is fine, and GPU speed, the GPU fan speed is constant, and it's not too loud. And by the way, I recommend playing this game. It's, it's pretty good. I haven't played much of it, but so far it's just amazing. not supposed to be here. I, I know, but something attacked Leon in the forest. My dear, I really wish I had the time to listen to your adventures, but... But it's true. Leon was lying there on the ground, and then he was... Shh. You ought to stay here with your brother. What? Why? What's Close happening? Close the door behind me and do not open the shutters, whatever happens. But... Hugo... 
He is not contagious. I realize you hardly know him, but he will be all right. Trust me, Amicia. Yes, mother. This is just the beginning of the game, by the way, so there are no spoilers. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, overclock and undervaulting successful. Okay, so if you like this video, make sure to leave a like and a comment. That'll help the algorithm. And if you want to see me do more, please subscribe. Honestly, I have no idea what to do with this channel. Like, I'm still trying to figure it out. And if you're willing to stay and watch me figure out whatever it is that i want to do then be sure to hit the subscribe button